What's up guys, Junkyard Junkie back here with another video. Today we're going to be showing you how to change the 12 volt outlet, also known as a cigarette lighter. Most people call them a cigarette lighter. But uh, we'll change this out and I'll show you why. As you can see, there's no power. But if you turn it, it'll get power for a second. But if you get it over here it actually will stay on it's hard to see it'll stay on in that one position but anywhere else you put it it just dies so I'm gonna replace it for with something I'm going to use on my new radio but you could actually just put another um, outlet in there and it'll work good as new okay so this is what we're going to be replacing it with it uh, goes in the cigarette lighter place and it comes to a aux port and a USB port that will plug into the back of the radio. So let's get started. Okay, so first you want a little pry tool. We're going to pry off these sides right here. All you got to do is stick it in here. Once you got it broke loose, that'll be good. Now we're just going to do the same thing to the other side. Honestly, don't even worry about the pry tool. It worked better just pulling it. Just like that. Now that's free. Now we're going to go up under here. We'll actually try to use the pry tool here. Okay, so just get up underneath it. Pry up. So just pull this up right here. Okay, now that you got this free, we're just going to unscrew the knob. Right out. Now this whole take that off. Straight up. Okay, so from here you just go to the back side of it. There's a little push tab. Push that in. Okay, so that part was a bit hard to see, but you gotta take in that hole and this hole. You wanna take a little flat head, stick it in there, press out while pushing up. On the back side, there's two tabs. One's right there, another one's on the other side. You're just pushing those outward and then pushing that down. Here, just push it on out. There we go. At this point, if you had a new one, you could just stick it back in there and plug it back up and you're good to go. Okay, guys, so what you want to do next is just pull right here on the back side, just pry up. Right out. Okay, so first we're going to take a little cover, put it over it, just run it through the wires, all the way up to the top. When 
what's up there. And be able to close. Okay guys, once you got that all the way up there, you should be able to just close it, just like that. Okay, next we're going to get this piece. We're going to run it through the wires, just like we did with that. All the way down. Now we're just going to tighten it all the way down. Doesn't have to be crazy, don't get a socket or anything, just turn it by hand. That should be good right there. Okay, now we're just going to feed the wires through the little centerpiece. So, just feed them right through. Get this lined up where you want. So I want mine where the USB is right there, the aux is right there. And you just want to kind of keep it in that location as you uh, tighten down the other bolt. So not bolt, sorry, nut. So here's the other one. got like a plastic washer on it. We're just going to feed that through the wires. All the way up to our back here. Like I said, I want to keep mine facing forward. So I'll have that position. I know you can't see it, but tighten this down while holding the other side still, that way it goes where you want it to go. Once again, you don't gotta go crazy with it. Hand tight's good enough. There you go. Now, it'll sit in there just like that. You'll be able to close it up when I'm not using it. And now we're just gonna put it back together. Okay, so first, I'll stick the wires back here. That way, whenever I start hooking up the radio, they will be there. And then we'll just go over, down, over. Okay, so go in there. Thing should click into place just like that. Then we just gotta put our sides back on. Just like that. Make sure you pop it all the way back. Take the little drive selector, put it back on, press down, just like that. Get your knob, and you can tell your hand's supposed to sit on it like that, with that going towards the front. So, just tighten it down. You don't want to go too crazy with it, but you want it tight. So, it's starting to get tight now. So, I'm just going to put it right there. That looks good to me. And that's all there is to it. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.